Higgins. Bruce was a bear who did not like the holidays. He used to stay in bed all winter long and skip right through the whole business. This is going to be a great Christmas. No migrating, no hibernating, just family. <laughs> But his family wanted to enjoy a cozy, snow-filled Christmas together. Oh. So Bruce was awake. Actually, bears don't hibernate. They spend the winter in a state of lethargy. Shh, you're ruining the Christmas spirit. I thought we were spending winter in the state of Maine. The geese had decked the halls, the mice made lots of eggnog. The holiday season was going to be filled with fun and cheer. Bruce did not like fun. Bruce did not like cheer. Bruce did not like fun or cheer. Mm. Bruce also did not like being cold, which is why he started wearing a long underwear and a warm hat. <gasps> and then it happened again. Are you Santa? <gasps> A case of mistaken identity. Bruce did not like mistaken identities. Mm. No, I am not. Go away. Oh my gosh, I met Santa. Wait right here while I go get my friends. <laughs> Wait. <sighs> I am not Santa! <clears throat> Bruce decided to ignore the problem until it went away. It did not. <gasps> it got worse. Did I hear someone knock? Who could it be? We should let them in! No! Don't open the door! I don't want all their dirty little feet in my... ...house! <laughs> <laughs> Santa! 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 And worse. Tell them I'm not Santa! <sighs> Everyone, listen up! Single file, no pushing! Santa Bruce has time to see all of you! Who wants Coco? Yay! Yay! And worse. Soon, word spread. I want 99 red balloons for Christmas! For Christmas, I want world peace! And all the little critters of the forest wanted to visit Santa Bruce to tell him what they wanted for Christmas. I want a race car!
because all the parents wanted to thank Bruce for his Christmas spirit. Bruce tried to tell them that he didn't have any. Bye, humbug. <sighs> That's when Thistle made an announcement. Bruce wants to say you're welcome and, what's more, Santa Bruce is going to deliver presents to all of your kids tonight. <laughs> it's a Christmas miracle! And with that, the parents left, shouting out with glee. Bruce did not like Glee. Finally, Bruce had it to bed. The mice had other ideas. <sighs> but what about getting ready for your big night? Yeah, what about the children? <sighs> Bruce put his foot down. I am having nothing to do with this. I will not deliver presents. <sighs> Besides, you don't have a sleigh. But the mice were persistent. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Soggy Hollow Express. Well, you don't have any reindeer. <sighs> The geese were helpful. Fine, fine. But there are no presents. And everyone was ready. By the way, what's in the boxes? Crackers. I'm still not going. Please. All you have to do is sit it in the sled. We'll give you chocolate eggs. <laughs> Finally, the grumpy old bear agreed to be Santa Bruce for one night. And everyone was very happy. I think we have too much weight in the sled. Almost everyone. This is going to be the best Christmas ever! <sighs> Being Santa Bruce was not an easy job. <sighs> that is not a cookie, that is soap. <clears throat> Mama Bunny, Papa Bunny, Baby Bunnies, Grown-Up Bunny who still lives with his parents. <sighs> and by the time Santa Bruce finally finished, the early morning light was creeping over a white Christmas. As all the critters of the forest awoke, they found presents waiting for them from Santa Bruce. Crackers! <laughs> Bruce had spread the spirit of Christmas all over the forest and brought everyone happiness. Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas Bruce. Bruce! Merry Christmas, Bruce! Yeah. Bruce did not like happiness. He liked sleeping, but Bruce's bed would have to wait. I'm sleeping through next Christmas. <sighs> Thank you.
Thank, Thank you, you for, for watching. watching. Subscribe.